Hello. Oh my god. Okay, it's been a crazy morning. I couldn't get any footage because like my hands were literally full. But I just moved in my dorm. I got the keys and my student ID card. Um, which is not these are my keys. And then my student ID ID card. I actually don't look half bad on here. I'll give you a little dorm tour. Like what the dorm is and everything. It's just giving me like old British England and the chimneys and things like that. Um, but like that building's, I think it's a library. That's definitely giving like White House vibes. And there's the stadium right there actually. So here are the elevators that you exit out of. And then you immediately greeted with the main lounge area. Here, and then there's rooms all the way down here and all the way down here. I'm to the right. So as you can see, it's like really weird furniture and carpeting, but it's like a nice clean, big space with like board games. There's a microwave and like a sink. Here's some water and we have bathrooms scattered around everywhere. Um, it's nice they put up everyone's name. Um, and there's also our resident assistant who lives here in this room. He's in charge of like keys and like roommates and all those admin stuff. Um, this is the study lounge. So I'm sure this will be useful in the future. And then, yeah, there's only a few rooms down here. It's much bigger on the left side. Um, we have trash here <laughs> and then my room's right here. Um, so ours is actually really big because it's a semi-suite. So there's two bedrooms and two bathrooms in our little room. I was having so much trouble opening this before. Like I just could not do it for the life of me. Anyway, yep. So we have an outside closet, which is just full of random stuff. Mini fridge, bathroom over here. So it's like pretty standard, I would say. But like, it's definitely nice because usually with dorms, you don't get your own like bathroom or like you don't get a shared bathroom or you have to pay a lot extra usually. You have like the really public ones with like a bunch in one line. But yeah, I could even put like your, to you know, skincare toiletries here. The shower, just also really nice. My bed, my desk, my drawers, my inside closet, and there's like this shared vanity thing. Yeah. So now my job is to unpack. So now I gotta eat my lunch that I bought. I went to the vegan cafe. It was a bit dodgy and looked a bit dirty, not gonna lie, but hopefully the food's good. I wish I was at Olive Garden. And then I'll probably check out the campus. Now that I have my ID card, I have access to everything like gyms, swimming pools, um, classrooms, I'm assuming, like anything really. So that's fun. I'll probably explore like so much today and tomorrow to learn just because um everyone's not, not moved in yet so i basically have the entire building to myself that i know of like i think it's only the ra and me at least on this floor so that's gonna be pretty fun um and i would need to tie myself out because i did not sleep well last night so i'm gonna tie myself out a lot today and then go to bed like at a reasonable hour and try not to wake up um i just realized that there's led lights all around as well that's so cute but yeah, so far so good. Time to unpack everything. This is gonna take a long while. Future Dean, please edit this out or time lapse this. Body wash, shampoo, conditioner, hand sanitizer, lotion, pad, book bag, tissues, disinfecting wipes, a hand soap, which thank God I bought because there's none in the bathroom. $45. I'm vlogging because I want to see, like, look back on it, but also because I'm so lonely. <laughs> I've only talked to like two people today, um, and there's no one in this building, and it's kind of, it's not really scary, but like, I just would rather feel like I'm talking to someone. After having a boyfriend for like nearly one and a half years, it's just weird being like completely solitude and also never really living apart away from your parents. This is just my coping mechanism, which I think is a great coping mechanism. How cute this is. Student life gave me like this bag for me and like a folder 
full of information. p.m. and I'm gonna go eat at the ramen bar which is like a seven minute walk from my dorm so it's not too bad the campus is so different at night a bit scary actually nearly 10 p.m. and I just finished settling in fully I showered I cleaned all the surfaces so it's been a long ass freaking day but I like the final product this is the final product I think my favorite is probably the desk just because it seems like the most lived in so we have health vitamins eye contacts cleaning supplies jewelry section tech section um, kind of like daily use section academic study section and then I love the pictures really adds personal touch um, in the drawer I just have like laptop stuff and like those are my important stuff like IDs keys purses um, in here we have underwear and bras um, and socks second drawer we have some summer clothes all my summer clothes that I bought actually and some sleeping clothes and leggings Last one is just really random, like, dirty clothes that I want to re-wear and, like, empty laundry bags and plastic bags and storage bags. Then we move on to my bed. We have Mr. Mini Chubbo chilling. This blanket sheds, unfortunately, but that's fine. We'll have a duvet later. Um, I hung my bags here because I feel like it's a good place to hang them. Shoes, I don't know if I should put here. Probably do because I was going to put it there, but it's kind of in the way of the door. I have my dirty laundry bags hanging on the bed. And then as for the vanity, we have, you know, tissues, tissues, <laughs> pads, food bin with like my cutlery behind and Ziploc bag, umbrella. And, and this is like all of my cold weather stuff, like beanies, gloves. And in here, we have random stuff up there that I still need to wash or like return or cut the tags off. I have my scarf hanging in this like hang a thing and then it's my very sad looking winter closet but it's fine i'm only here for like four months so this should be enough and if anything i'll just buy a bit more hi this is future jane in august this was filmed all the way back in january so if you have any questions about umd at all the application process moving process dorm situations classes feel free to leave it down in the comments and i will reply back to you thank you for watching i hope you have a great day